The latest government report showing the job market is still strong, but starting to lose momentum. The U.S. economy added 223,000 jobs in December, down slightly from previous months. The unemployment rate dipped to 3.5 percent, a half-century low. Economists calling it a Goldilocks report. We're seeing a slower demand for labor, but still a fairly robust labor market overall. And we are starting to see some initial signs that wage growth is moderating, which is really what the Fed has been looking for in its fight against inflation. The biggest job gains were in leisure and hospitality, health care and construction. For all of last year, the economy added four and a half million jobs, the second most on record. But experts say it's still too early for the Fed to declare victory in its fight against inflation. What this December jobs report points to is an environment where wage growth is less concerning and where the Fed may be able to start raising rates at a slower pace than it has been doing over the prior months. Wages rose 4.6 percent from the previous year, but well below a March peak of 5.5 percent. Still, consumers are struggling to pay bills with paychecks that are not keeping up with inflation. Recent high-profile layoffs at companies including Amazon, Salesforce, Redfin and Goldman Sachs could signal a further slowdown ahead as businesses brace for a possible recession. The Fed predicts that the unemployment rate will rise to about 4.6 percent by the end of this year as its string of interest rate increases force companies to tighten their belts. Alexis Christophorus, ABC News, New York.